guys welcome back to my channel so I just picked up this new foundation so I thought I would try a first impression video um, I've never done one of these before so I don't really know how to go but this is the bourgeois Paris healthy mix serum gel foundation and it says it's 16 hours of radiant boosting even revived complexion and it's supposed to give light coverage so I've wanted to try this for over a year I think I first heard about it on Essie Buttons channel and I've always wanted to try it. I want, asked my husband to buy it for me when he was here last year, but he ended up getting the um, regular Healthy Mix foundation and not the serum. And I did like that one. That one's more of a medium coverage foundation. So I'm excited to give this one a okay. shot. I'm gonna start with the Dr. Brandt Pores No More foundation, foundation, pore refining primer, um, just cause that's what I've been using every day. And I already did my eye makeup, obviously. Um, I did the Lorac Pro. And I used Garnet um, on the outer lid, gold on the inner lid. And then I uh, put Nude all over to kind of lighten it up a little bit. And the mirror is right behind my camera. So sorry if I like go out of frame a little bit to see what I'm doing. But I also have a mirror down here, so I will get that out. Okay, so I guess I'll start with one side to see if I can tell a difference, and I'm going to use my beauty blender. Sorry, it's a little dirty. I forgot to buy some soap to clean it with yesterday. I'll have to do that today. So I'm going to put one pump on the back of my hand, and then I guess I'll do that. Let's see. I don't know if I really tell a huge difference. I mean, my skin is pretty... I don't have any huge problems with, with redness or anything, so... It's kind of hard to say. I mean, looking closer, I feel like I see a little bit of a difference, but it is a very light coverage foundation. But I don't have anything like that right now, I don't think. I do have some BB creams and CC creams. But um, this one is actually really full coverage, um, medium to full, I guess. And yeah, I don't really have any light cover. I don't really have any light coverage foundations, so this is definitely something different for my collection. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on both sides. I'm gonna use my fingers for the other side and see if that's any different. Okay, so I feel like I got a little bit better coverage on the side I use my fingers, but it feels a little, there's little places where it's kind of built up. So and now I'm going to go in with my beauty blender and kind of blend it out. Okay, so that is the foundation. I feel like it's a very good color match. And I did get the same shade that I had in the other Healthy Mix foundation, which just for reference is number 52 Vanilla. And I do really like the coverage. I feel like, I mean, it is very light, but that's all I really need. I don't really like full coverage foundation. I usually stick to medium to light or, you know, do a layer layer. So I really like it so far. I feel like it did kind of even out my complexion a little bit, um, reduce a little bit of the redness, like in my cheeks and stuff. So I guess we'll see how it lasts throughout the day. I don't know if I'm going to remember to check in. And if I do, it might be on my phone because... I'm not gonna, you know, set all this stuff up again, so I guess we'll see, but I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my makeup right now, and then I will, I guess, 
show you what it looks like all put together. Hey guys! So I finished my makeup. I got a little distracted so it's been a little bit over an hour but this is what it looks like and I will try to remember to check in later. Um, so, so far I do like it but you know you can't really tell until you've kind of worn it for a whole day. So I will check in later and see you then. Hey guys! Just checking in. So it is about 4 o'clock and I think I did my makeup when did I do it? Like 10 or 11 o'clock? I think it was about 10.30 maybe. So I think the foundation is holding up pretty well. I don't, I haven't noticed any, anything bad I guess. I don't know, I feel, I feel like my face looks pretty good. Um, I mean it's a very light coverage foundation so it's not super noticeable to begin with, but I am still liking it so far so I haven't done anything too crazy. I've just been sitting in a cafe working on a paper so haven't like been sweating or running around or anything too much but yeah just thought I would check in and say hello see how it's going so I think I really like this foundation I mean I wouldn't say it's as exciting as I thought it might be I don't know just like I feel like using the word serum and gel makes it sound very different but I didn't really notice a texture difference or anything, but I do really like it. So I don't know if I'll buy another bottle. I might, but I mean, it's only been one day, so we will see how it goes and how much I like it after a little bit longer. Hey guys, so it is about 9 p.m. and I still think the foundation looks very good. It hasn't, I haven't noticed any bad changes or anything in it the way that it looks so I'm very pleased with this foundation so far I definitely will be wearing it a lot over the next month because it is the only liquid foundation I have with me now I did bring a, a cosmetics CC cream but I don't love that one so I'll probably be sticking mostly to this and also my powder foundation from Bare Minerals so I'm very pleased with this I'm not sure if I love it so much that I'm gonna buy another bottle but um, I will make that decision, you know, the last week I'm here. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye!